unscripted mm-hmm. yes yeah, so unscripted today it's a hip hop affair and we have a guest artist all the way from Migori County mm-hmm. yes i told you what people is all about supporting talent and i see it to county more that juzi ilikuwa kisi leo ni migori next week si juni wapi like we just like supporting talent from day one set you kuna hii hashtag play kenyan music no mm-hmm. we've been playing kenyan music for the longest time and we always have artists come through and you know artists if you know kazi yako ni poa na inaweza make on tv at karaoke live whatever for send us that link inboxes on facebook and definitely come on unaweza we'll call you for the interview but about now we have robert oko gang mm-hmm. the, the only gang kwa sababu unscripted mm-hmm. nile story yangu tunacha, tunachambua sanii right. kwa sababu nyuki wana yenyeje huko down usiogope opportunity kwa ndani wa kifai kwa sababu tunawapatia mpaka mtoki wa down hapana lazima ujiamini lazima ujiamini go back to this atamua. go back to the studio and work mm-hmm. you have to work you have to work and depend on your studio ni sababu make sure your friends listen to your mm-hmm. songs mabishi zako even strangers wakikwambia ngoma inaweza mm-hmm. then you release it usitoe tu ngoma bado and if you feel that au na production tafuta d atakuwa vile <laughs> adi ni nani facebook d tafuta tu d hapana anjo d nani suambie facebook at after nani no na kitu ni d production peke yake d production yeah. awesome guys so how about we check that out and we'll be right back All right, welcome to the show guys. Like I told you we have Robert Ouko gang in the studio representing for Karaoke Live. How are you? I'm fine, thank you. All right, good to have you in the studio. This is your first time? Uh, this is my first time here. Mm-hmm. I appreciate so much. You're most welcome. All right, so let's talk about your name. Your name is Robert Ouko gang. Your artistic name. Tell us about that. How did that come about? Okay. Ma, let me start. I was born born in Migori. Raised partly in Migori, right. then I moved to Nairobi. So when I was born, uh, my mom told me my dad started. My dad, my dad they used to like politics yeah. so much. So my dad started me. My government names are John Troon. Mm. So you remember John Troon, the guy from Scotland. Right. So th- by the time he came to Kenya to investigate Robert's Oko's death, yeah. Yeah, I, was, I was being born. Oh, <laughs> that makes sense. It makes a lot of sense. Yeah. So, <laughs> yeah. so to me, yeah. I didn't want to use John Troon because mm-hmm. I felt it's somehow Western. Yeah. So I wanted an African name. Right. So I, I, I went, I went to Robert Uko. Back to your roots. Yeah, back to my roots. <laughs> <laughs> I went to Roberto. So I chose Roberto Uko. Mm-hmm. Then I added Gang to mm-hmm. keep in touch with John Troon. Ah, nice. <laughs> that makes sense. All right. So um, you are a hip hop artist. Yeah. I'm a Right. So what kind of art, what kind of hip hop do you have you settled on? Because right now we have mambo rappers. We have uh, guys who do um you know this hardcore and then we have the trap music now. So what kind of hip hop are you doing? Okay. From my name. Yeah. You hate some of cultural. <laughs> <laughs> Robert Uko. Uh-huh. That's some of cultural. Right. So to me starting out I, I started by finding my sound. I could find my sound. It took me so long. Right. Then one day, I don't know, something just happened. Now. Mm-hmm. I fell in love with Afro, Afro rap. Right. As in, I blend my music. I blend uh, Kiswa. Mm-hmm. I blend English, mm-hmm. and I blend my mother tongue in it. Yeah. So it's some somehow Afro Afro rap, oh. but hip hop. All right. Well, we like to see that. We'll be hearing from him. He'll have to do something for us, but yeah. that's a bit a little bit later on. So, when did you get started? Okay, officially officially, let me say. All my life has been music. <laughs> it's right, been music. but let's talk professionally. Oh, when did you first go to the studio? Can you even remember the first song you wrote? Yeah, I can remember the first song. <laughs> <I wrote. laughs> but it was really work. Yeah, so up, the first time in studio, mm-hmm. but I tried. Right. I tried. It. So, professionally I started uh, let me say 2015. Right. started doing music as business now mm-hmm. yeah in 2015 in 2015 yeah. all right so what can you say drove you to start doing music and hip hop for that matter why who made you love fall in love with hip hop or just uh, being an artist what what drove you to do music okay 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 <laughs> yeah <laughs> so me me after 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 clearing high school okay right. i had a friend mm-hmm. his name was in high school i remember back when in high school right. from from two i had a friend who, who was a rapper me by the way i was a poet in high school <laughs> i used to yeah. write i used to write poetry yes so the person sitting next to me his name is alfitin yeah this is the guy who made me rap 
Mm-hmm. Yeah. He used to sit next to me. Mm-hmm. Uh, when, when the teacher's not around, I could hear him scrabble his books, write, rap. <laughs> me, I'm there, I'm writing my poems. I'm, I'm asking, Alfie, how about this? He's yeah. saying, that's dope, that's dope. That's nice, yeah. yeah. Can you put it into words, yeah? Mm-hmm. Something like spoken words. Mm-hmm. Or can you rap? Yeah. I said, I'll try. Uh, I started learning, learning. Mm-hmm. Ah, like that. All right. I fell love in. I fell love with the rap music. Yeah. Oh, great! Yeah. So, um, how has the journey been for you? Like, let's say from 2015 until right now, have you made any steps? How has the journey been? Has it been challenging? Has it been easy? Tell us about that. <laughs> yeah. Easy. Forget about it. <laughs> <laughs> I know, right? Yeah, yeah. Uh-huh. Ah, we've passed through valleys. Yeah. Hills. Mm-hmm. And uh, you're still a lot, going. a lot, a lot. <laughs> so me being an, uh, by the way, I'm an independent artist. Right. Yeah. Mm-hmm. No label. Mm-hmm. Just me. Mm-hmm. Some team I work with. Mm-hmm. So we've been trying pushing our music. Mm-hmm. I know Kenyan industry there is so tough to break. Yeah. Yeah. So mm-hmm. we must be consistent. Right. But we've tried. <laughs> we've tried. Though it's it's not easy. Right. It's not easy. Yeah. You have to sweat. Mm-hmm. Sweat. It's always sweat. Pain, yeah. blood, <laughs> blood, sweat, and tears. Uh, I always say, mm-hmm. my sweat on the floor, mm-hmm. yeah, turn my flows into gold. Mm-hmm. You feel? Yeah. 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 <laughs> <laughs> All right. So, um, are you planning to beef with anyone? Because I hear like hip hop. <laughs> for you to to like you know break out, you have to start a scandal, just controversy. Are you planning on doing that with anyone? <laughs> In Kiswahili, let me say it's called Kiki. Yes, Kiki, exactly. Kiki. Yes, you get me. Uh, an artist said in Tanzania, mm. Kiki, leave kick for the motorbike. Uh-huh. Uh, okay, I don't know me. what that means, but sour. Yeah, you know, well, okay. Mm-hmm. To start a motorbike, yeah. you have to kick it. Oh, yeah. true. That's, yeah. that's, what he, what, that's what he meant. Oh. So to me, me all, all, all the way to today, right. I always believe in myself. Mm-hmm. So no beef to right. break. Mm-hmm. No beef or what? Right. Maybe beef, 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 beef are healthy. If beef are commercial, mm-hmm. if they pay, if they're bringing in, uh, money. they bring food to the table. Right. Ah, bring them. Okay. I'll beef you up. Right. Eat. <laughs> <laughs> nice. And you have a new song out, Pelele, if I'm not wrong. Yeah, Pelele. Tell us about that. How did that come about? Okay, Pelele. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's way back. I, I'll still take you back to high school. Mm-hmm. Okay, high school, you know. There are so many challenges. Right. Peer, peer mm-hmm. pressure, what, groupies. Mm-hmm. So, to me, to me, I was an individual who was only, I always wanted to be, but then surviving in high school, mm-hmm. I had a key. Yeah. I was always alone. Mm-hmm. You were a loner. I was a loner. Yeah. To survive, and mm-hmm. I survived. Right. So, I never liked groupies. Mm-hmm. So, I, I only had one friend, I, I won't say his name, mm-hmm. he was so notorious. <laughs> <laughs> he was so so notorious. Mm-hmm. So he was the one always pushing me. Ah, Robert Huko, I say I like the way you rap, man. Mm-hmm. Don't, don't just give up. Right. So him being notorious, mm-hmm. he used to make some stuff. I was saying sometimes you get bored. Mm-hmm. So he realized something. I, I don't know if you have you fermented fermentation. Do you know fermentation? Yeah. So this I guy, know ferment, yeah. this guy could tell me true. School is closed, but when school opens come back with a lot of sugar. <laughs> Feel me? Yeah. So, me, I, I used to bring sugar. Mm-hmm. Then he used to fam- he mix, he mixes sugar with water. Yeah. Then he ferments. Oh, you let it stay for like uh, three days some, or so? Uh, yeah, some days. Well, yeah. Three days is a few. So yeah. mo- many days <laughs> for it to be real. <laughs> then what does that make? As in, it, it used to make something so... <laughs> I don't know how to say. <laughs> something so close to... As in, if you take it, you feel dizzy. Oh, yeah. all right. Yeah, so, Pelele, I wrote Pelele last year, mm-hmm. August. So right. I flashed back that life, mm-hmm. to what we went through. Mm-hmm. He used to make it, it was real. <laughs> and we used to drink, yeah. <laughs> it was real, we used to drink. Yeah. So he used to call it Pelele. Yeah. As in, in my tongue, Pelele mm-hmm. means alcohol. Oh. Another name, that's another name for, it's Congo, in oh. Kijaluo, Congo. Oh. Or Pelele. So that's why I said it. I, I decided no. to write Pelele. Uh, 
<laughs> All right, so uh, since you are a uh, dope artist and you yeah. believe in yourself, but we want the guys at home to see that yeah. because uh, as a hip hop artist, you know, you have to do either freestyle, just yeah. do something for us. Since also yeah. the show is called karaoke, and karaoke is all about singing. Yeah. If you cannot sing, you rap. You rap. Yeah, so do something yeah. for us. I'll fix the mic. Yes, take the mic. Je, 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 je. ROG, Roberto Uko Ganga, Skia. Chia, Iga Kano Chako, Dongi Luongoa, Dari Dongi Kelo, Dongi Wondoa, Dari Biro Gero, Skunde Biro Medo, Koro Ere, Dara Richo Richo, Gweng Ongestima, Dongi Dak, Idak Kakapelo, Nyoro Kai Kai, Ekinoma Kelo, Nyar Nya Semo, Chakinoma Uma, Nyar Nya Suna, Dara Poki Gero, Skunde Poki Medo, Monting Etero, Zee. Check, check, nigga, flow eco sick, itaji hosi, miss itaji hosi, call that nigga, nigga do key, flow eco noma, owner, street zime shona, shona, madam kila kona, what any one noma, 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 something like that. Good stuff, good stuff, guys. What did you think about that? Head over to our social media handles at Karaoke Live White to Pepper. That's for Facebook and Twitter. And on Instagram, Karaoke underscore Live White to Pepper. At Feeling Zoom, let us know what you thought about his music. And how is that? Is he able to ambient, right? Yeah. All right, so who are you looking forward to work with in the 254? Because you have a lot of artists, you have a lot of rappers. Anyone you're looking forward to working with? And uh, who do you say actually inspires you? Okay, me. Yeah. <laughs> me growing up. Uh -huh. I'm so choosy, man. <laughs> but a lot of artists inspires me. Mm -hmm. uh, but I can see one who inspired me the most. I can work with Octopizo. Mm -hmm. Octopizo, I feel his music. He's dope, he's hardworking. He's an independent artist. Yeah. But they, he gives me that motivation. Right. You know, recording music, then shooting videos, from your own pocket, it's not easy, you know? Then shooting videos abroad, mm -hmm. that's something so dope, man. So, Octopizo mm -hmm. is so dope. King Kaka, fresh, fresh. Mm -hmm. Even the OG, OG is so, so cool, man. <laughs> looking to working, to, I'm looking to working to, with them. Man. Oh. Yeah, fresh. Calligraph, Calligraph Jones, yeah, right. man. he's so dope. But the Calligraph has pushed Kenyan music so, so badly. Yeah. And yeah. I have respect for him. Yeah. That's why me, I always tell him, I you see you call yourself OG. Mm -hmm. I always say that's Omolo's grind, Danny. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I hope you watch nice. these. Uh, nice. <laughs> Now, hey, Calligraph, a big shout out to you if you're watching this. Now we have a new meaning to your name. It's not the OG, we know it. Now it's uh, Omolo's Grind. That makes sense. We have to grind. We're going to get that mola by all means. <laughs> Robert Ouko Gang, what should your fans expect from you? 2019 is still fresh. What are you doing for us? Robert Ouko Gang, Joe. And what to expect too? What is Shanghai? Yeah. This year, Joe, this is my year. <laughs> <laughs> this is my year. I know, year, it has man. to be. Yeah. Yes. Nilianza on a high note. Mm -hmm. uh, January, kuna ngoma tayari kwa out. Yeah. Inajita nyango. Mm -hmm. It's hot, man. Right. Shout out to, to MK, mm -hmm. One Beat Records. Right. The, by the way, he's the one making my music. Oh, nice. Uh, MK on the beats. Mm -hmm. yeah, really dope stuff. A lot of music. Yeah. More videos, quality music, mm -hmm. and... Uh, Wangoje tu, how wangoje tu. Ntawalisha leo, nawalisha this year sana. We're looking forward to that. We can't wait to see that. Right, so for guys who are just joining us, maybe you would love to remind them your social media handles, yeah. Twitter, or Facebook, or YouTube. Where can they find your music? Yeah. And where can they find you across all social media platforms? Yeah. Mine is simple, yani. Mm -hmm. Atos, uta sumbuka. Yeah. Robert Ouko Gang, yani. Mm -hmm. Ukieka tu yomi, uta nipata, yani. Kila mahali. Yeah, kila mahali, yani. All right. So you have any shout outs? Any some anyone you want to send some love to? You yeah. just like any shout outs before you wrap up? Yeah, first shout out kwaza ni kwako ya. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, it's not easy na juu yeah. lakini like yeah. Ah, yeah. uh, next yeah. shout out ni kwa studio pale hivyo. Ah maze kufanya kazi maze. Unajua hizi stories za kurecord nini maze? Si rahisi man. Na shout out MK pale hivyo. One beat maze. Shout out to my mom, who back at home, my oh, <laughs> <my mom. 
Hapa kiwachi mzee. Eh mzee. Alafu jo hudi yangu jo county yangu jo migori mzee. Yeah. Yaani mimi nasema ga nita nimeweka migori mabig gani yani. Nice. Like a snapper. Nice. Ah, no, it's a good thing to be proud of your roots, where you're from. It's a good thing, yeah. So I always call Migori gold city. In Migori, we mine so, so gold. Yeah. My mom, my mom, my mom herself, is, she mines gold. Oh, nice. Yeah, it's a gold mine. <laughs> I always make fun. Yeah. You come to Migori, uh-huh. we'll give you Gideri on a gold plate. Ah. So you'll have to think. Yeah. <laughs> so shout out to gold city. Yeah. Gold city all. Everybody there. Mm-hmm. Keep it locked. Your boy, mm. Roberto Uko Gang, this year, man. This, this year, that year. <laughs> awesome. That's, yeah. Thank you so much for coming through. It's been a pleasure having uh, you. Thank you so much. Man. All right. I appreciate it. So, um, everybody who comes here, you have to take us on a break. Like, all artists do that. So, I want you to take the mic and uh, take us on a break. Because we want to listen to your song. So, do that for us. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Thank you for watching the interview. Uh, I've been hosted by 254, I appreciate, I appreciate so much, <laughs> you're laughing, right? Eh? Yeah, but now we have to go for com- commercial break, we have to pay some bills, you know? Yeah, yeah we'll be back shortly. Yay! Bwe, 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 bwe.